two finalists at the China Open both possessed those qualities of movement and strength of mind required to attain greatness. Number one seed Andy Murray, the master retriever at full stretch. And the flamboyance and self-belief of Grigor Dimitrov. Time for the battle for the prestigious China Open trophy to get underway. Murray led the head-to-head 7-2, -head but Dimitrov had beaten the world number two earlier this year in Miami. And after the number one seed broke Dimitrov's opening service game, he then consolidated his position. Acrobatic finish from Andy Murray to that rally. But the world number 20 is looking back to his best and fought his way out of a hole in the third game. after this one. Oh, he's done well. Dimitrov's done even better. What reactions from Grigor Dimitrov. And what a start to this final. Some electric tennis from both players now. However, Murray was holding firm on serve to stand one set for a first title in Beijing. There it is, though. Andy Murray, with a clench of the fist, will be delighted with the start he's made. Despite Dimitrov having the night off in his semi-final walkover win, it was Murray who was looking the fresher as the match wore on. Yeah, a little flick from Murray. Murray had it covered, anticipated and read the signs from Dimitrov that this was going to just creep over the net and he was off down the court like a shot. Real energy about that point from both players. But as the Scots served for the match, his composure suddenly deserted him. Oh, he's missed. He's missed the doubles court. But in the tie-break, Dimitrov's level dropped, and Murray stood at championship points. He's long, Dimitrov goes long, and Andy Murray is champion in Beijing for the first time. He wins his first ever China Open, his 40th career title, and the top seed has lived up to his billing. You know, it was a week where I didn't have loads of preparation coming into it and you know, I did feel like if I sort of managed to get through my first couple of matches I'd feel better as, as the week went on and the last two matches for me was a you know, much, much better level. It was very tough uh, today with Grigor. I think he played a lot better than he did a few weeks ago when we played at the US Open, so I'm happy I managed to get through it. Following a glittering week of tennis in Beijing, there was one player who'd been imperious throughout. The number one seed, Annie Murray, didn't drop a set all week and dismissed every challenger with consummate ease. A 40th career ATP World Tour title and a first China Open triumph. Your 2016 champion in Beijing, Andy Murray.